The only argument that people will make about James Harden actually being better than Anthony <laughs> Davis is he's on a better team. But it's supposed to be an individual award. You want to give the, the award to Harden's teammates, go ahead. But if you're trying to isolate value, the answer is Anthony Davis so far. Well, you're wrong, but there's no surprise there. And I understand why, because you read and you're a scientist, really. I don't even know why you're on television talking sports as far as I'm concerned. You can do politics. You can do math, philosophy. Don't get me started. You can give lessons on those things, okay? I, doing, doing, doing I mean, I mean, this, this is what you do. I totally understand. I get where you're coming from. And I'm not here to poo-poo Anthony Davis because I know the brother's big time. But it ain't James Harden's fault that he ain't 6'11", okay? I mean, James Harden is what he is. He's a 6'4", 6'5", guard and he is nothing short of sensational. I am not going to allow what happened to James Harden, even though it was legitimate last year, because Russell Westbrook stole the last two weeks of the season by being Herculean, and as a result, he ended up walking away with league MVP honors. I am not going to let that happen to James Harden this year. I don't give a damn if I've got to lead the parade. This man will win league MVP uh, this year. This man is nothing short of sensational. Just call it what it is in terms of points, in terms of assists, in terms of impact. That sometimes that offensive impact is what is a, is a form of defense because when you're so stellar, when you're so surreal offensively, it can demoralize the opposition. Let's remember that last year when James Harden was a runner up for league MVP, Houston won 55 games, New Orleans won 21. This year, they're at 57 wins. They're 16 games better than the New Orleans Pelicans. Now, I understand that there's a collection of parts that Houston has around it right now because you got CP3 to add to the mix that you already had in place last year. I get all of that. But the consistency with which James Harden has put forth what he has put forth simply cannot be denied. We understand that James Harden ain't in the same stratosphere as Anthony Davis individually as a defender. We totally get that. We recognize that if you had to pick between the two as to who's the better player per se, it's Anthony Davis. That's not what this award is about. This award is about the individual season that you're having and the impact that it ultimately has as a residual impact on the rest of your team. And when you look at the Houston Rockets, when you walk on the court with these guys, even with Anthony Davis, it don't matter who you're going up against, every game is a thriller. You know why it's a thriller? Because Anthony Davis, as great as he is, can only do so much. James Harden can break you down. He can humiliate you. He can embarrass you. He can strip your heart right out of your chest. He can put in points from all over the place. He's an assist waiting to happen. He can play the point. He can play the two. And when you take all of those things into consideration and you look at what he's bringing to the table, the offensive impact that he has on the floor, on the floor is so profound that it offsets some of the defensive liabilities he and the rest of his team may have. That's why they've got 57 wins on this season, and they're going to be the number one seed in the Western Conference. James Harden is my league MVP. I can assure you I will not change my mind. I don't give a damn what happens over the next two weeks. He is the league MVP, and when this award, this award is handed out, and oh, by the way, Max, can we get rid of that bogus Players Association ceremony that takes place after the damn season is over? No. James Harden and deserves to have the league MVP. He deserves to be on the court in the playoffs at the Toyota Center with the commissioner handing him that trophy and him hoisting it in front of 19 to 20,000 people who have been there to cheer him all year long instead of these damn players that show up at a beautiful posh hotel in New York City or somewhere else to have a ceremony for themselves. The fans deserve to he see James Harden MVP. hoist that trophy and I expect him to do just that. The only argument that people will make about James Harden actually being better than Anthony <laughs> Davis is he's on a better team. But it's supposed to be an individual award. You want to give the, the award